Hello everybody, this is Bui from Mama Bui's Kitchen. I hope you're having a great day. Today guys, we are making vanilla band cake. This cake is moist, fluffy, and it's made with basic kitchen staples. It's so easy to make and it's best thing guys with vanilla flavor. It's baked to golden perfection and topped with powdered sugar so guys let's get started you know mama we doesn't like to waste time now let's get into the ingredients you'll need flour baking soda baking powder salt cornstarch cooking oil sugar milk butter vinegar vanilla extract and three eggs let's get started in a medium bowl, sift together the flour, cornstarch, salt, baking soda, and baking powder. Once done, set aside. Now let's move on to work on our wet ingredients. In a separate bowl, add butter, sugar, and oil. Using an electric mixer, cream together for two minutes until light and creamy. I'm using creamy method here, guys, and the recommended creaming time of around two minutes provides enough time for this process to occur ensuring that the butter or oil and sugar are well combined and that the batter is aerated properly. Now you can see our batter is light and fluffy. Now we're gonna scrape the sides of the bowl, then move on to add in eggs, one at a time, mix well in between each addition. I had a lot of questions some people want to know why do i add eggs one at a time adding eggs one at a time is a practical technique to achieve a well mixed stable batter and to control the texture and rise of the final big cake also adding eggs one at a time when baking is a technique used to ensure that they are incorporated into the batter evenly and gradually next using a spatula we're gonna go ahead and scrape the bowl on all sides next add in vanilla and vinegar mix until well combined so you might be wondering why we are adding white vinegar so in recipes that use both baking soda and baking powder as leavening agent, vinegar can enhance the leavening action. When combined with other leavening agents, vinegar helps ensure that the cake rises evenly and consistently during baking. Next, we are adding in our dry ingredients turn your mixer on low speed then mix this for two minutes alternating with the milk we're gonna start with the dry and finish with the dry ingredients our mixer looks good now we're gonna set that aside next we are going to grease our pan pan with a non-stick baking spray I love using Baker's Joy guys. When I use it, I find that the combination of oil and flour together guarantees a mess-free, perfect release every time. Next, we are going to pour the batter into our prepared burnt pan and distribute the batter evenly. Once done pouring the batter into the pan, go ahead with a spatula and smooth the top. Our cake is ready for the oven. We're gonna bake it for one hour until a toothpick inserted in the middle comes out clean. Now 
I just pulled out the cake from the oven guys we're gonna do the toothpick test or you can just tell when you see the cake like here guys it has pulled from the pan it means it's done then we're gonna invent it onto a cooling rack to cool completely make sure your baking pan guys has cooled enough to handle i don't want you to burn yourself perfect the cake is done now we're gonna let it cool completely then we're gonna dust it with powdered sugar you can pair this cake with a scoop of ice cream a drizzle of sauce or a cup of coffee there you have it guys vanilla band cake i hope you enjoyed this video guys this cake is so delicious i hope you'll try it this cake is moist with a tender crumb now it's time to cut a slice and see if we did good look at that guys look how moist it is it's gonna melt in your mouth <laughs> don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notifications guys mama we released a new cookbook i'll leave the link down in the notes and please support this lady because more recipes are coming your way thanks for watching and enjoy this delicious cake <music>